Oh man, y'all, this game was my bread and butter. I'm, I'm not even kidding. I slept with the instruction booklet under my pillow. <laughs> I was a fangirl and very vulnerable. I mean, shit happens. We all have you our have. fans that we, we just took, we just took into our hearts way too deep. Right. And it came out of our ass and came back into our mouth, and it just kind of, you know, wormed our way back and forth, up and down. I, I don't know how long I want to take this image. You have way more bullets. 89 is bigger than 22. See, this game teaches you math. It <laughs> sure, it does. It's a good game. Like, it, uh, for some reason, it desperately wants you to count to 13. Like, holy shit, it has 13 <laughs> endings. It does, yes. Um, so, like I said, uh, 12 of the original, and then the last story. Um, which, I mean, I do... <laughs> well, I'll, I'll save my, my, my comments on the last story for when we actually play it. But uh, <laughs> I mean, just, what, what uh, I meant my, to say my... is, wow, so many options. I mean, this is amazing. This is so good. Right? Yeah, this there's so, so many options. Um, <laughs> so, a little bit about the meters up top. You see the red and blue there. Um, obviously, killing humans and stuff raises your dark meter, but it also, like, just causing general destruction, like breaking shit and flipping over buses like I've been doing, that'll also raise your dark meter. Which is the red Yes, stuff? that is the red one. And then the blue one is chaos control. I always miss this guy. Sorry. So what happens when your red meter's all the way up? My red, when my red meter's all the way up, I get to use a chaos blast, which is the big explodey thing that you saw me use earlier. Okay, so the two moves are chaos blast and chaos control? Yes, yep. Chaos Control will speed me through the stage unless I'm in a boss stage, in which case it will freeze time. Okay. All right. <laughs> I love you're just like, freezing time? That's yeah, such I mean, a... Like, also, <laughs> Chaos Control, totally not an oxymoron. I mean, like, this, right. it's so... I mean, the well, yeah, names see, are that's just the, so good. Yeah, that's the joke, you see. It's, it's, it's Chaos Control. That should never happen. You know what I really can't wait for is the day that you and I... Uh, podcast sonic x if we ever do so <laughs> and the unfortunate thing is is in that podcast we will be nowhere near as intoxicated as we actually are when we watch that show <laughs> we have to truly convey how like how are we going to convey how we, what we are the state we're in when we decide it's sonic x it's time. usually for for so you're aware audience it's usually at like two o'clock in the morning and we've been drinking since dinner <laughs> All right, we can't pick up the Chaos Emerald because uh, Doom's gonna steal it when we're doing other things. Does oh it, yeah, oh yeah, we only have two left. Doesn't fine. it feel good as a, like how original are we? We are a Sonic character and we just looked at a giant jewel and went, no, nah, not for me today. Yeah, no. and we're also carrying a gun. <laughs> That's I really bold. I don't need a Chaos Emerald, <laughs> I have a gun. Boom, we did it. The boom. We killed all humans. And a few yeah. robots, let's be honest. Today we'll live in infamy. Oh, how did I get one anyway? Oh, we got one on the way. Oh, whatever. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. It's fine. There were two in the stage. We got one on the way. Are you sure it has nothing to do with the fact that they just pre-programmed that animation <laughs> and they couldn't think of another one? Well, sometimes he just crosses his arms and stares at the Oh, that's camera. true. Be all moody. See, there's two. There's They had so much money that they animated two forms of shit. <laughs> Here's a heterochromic <laughs> weird man. Like, I, I feel some of, I feel a little guilty because at that age, oh my God, I loved Shadow. I did. I loved yeah. Shadow. This, again, if this game landed in my hands, oh, it would, oh, I would, oh, Jesus Christ. My, my, they're at us. <laughs> Insolent fools. Wanted in connection with the terrorist attacks. Last seen in the vicinity of Yeah, we are a terrorist, like if you really think about it. I love how we're using the rhetoric of terrorism in a sonic. We game. are just causing terrorism. Stop! Don't move! Or we'll Who hired shoot. you? Stupid humans. Stupid humans. Wait! We'll bait! Bitch slap humanity if I want to. <laughs> Yeah, and man, like, I, I didn't grow up with Naruto. I knew what it was, but I didn't watch it. Um, but I mean, like, the, the Sasuke character, when I was 10, I would have been all over that. Oh, yeah. Almost every rebel character, like, the the, the hero's antagonist, not antagonist, but, like, the hero's anti-person, the rebel character. You, this is, yeah, 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 yeah. No, I, I definitely know what you mean. It's the, 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 not the anti-hero, because that, that has all different connotations, but it's, it's, 
the the hero in it's the in, alternative in, choice for the, for the antagonist. Yeah, yeah. The 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 heroes in in a lot of oh look we're in the internet again. That was quick, <laughs> but almost. With the exception of Vegeta, who I found to be a whiny bitch. Oh, I have to show you a post later. <laughs> um, yeah, I would just hook, line, and sinker. Oh, it didn't no, take and see, much. I was all about Vegeta. He's so fucking whiny. I don't care. He's fucking. Okay, now. He's keep... not broody, he's whiny. Now, keep in mind, my first experience with Dragon Ball Z was a Majin Buu sock. After he's gone through his oh, character. He's a little better at that point, yeah. I mean, his son, oh, my goodness, bend me over uh, and take yes. me. Yeah, and then <laughs> I, I didn't know who Trunks was at first. Then I saw a picture of him, I was like, who is this gorgeous but, motherfucker? But when, okay, when Trunks doesn't have uh, a f the f evil future Trunks upbringing, he's also a whiny bitch. He takes after his whiny bitch father. Also Bulma, who's also a whiny bitch. Right. That, that entire family is just a bunch of whiny bitches. Okay, so Milo, we have two missions. We can follow Black Doom and just get to the end. Oh, we're killing people. Or we can find the Chaos Emeralds with Rouge. Whose arms are weirdly, weirdly fucking long in this game. It's it's the mannerist period of the Renaissance. You know? <laughs> well, that's, that's what we do. Um, I am going to be evil. Okay. I've determined unless evil. unless we get to a stage that's too hard. I, I will say the next uh, if we do the dark stage, um, the next stage we do we can't be evil because I refuse to do that stage. Just, I, let's, okay. Uh, what's, this we, what's this we shit? You can't be evil. <laughs> um, excuse me. Would you <laughs> like the controller, you little sassy bitch? <laughs> I'm just being naughty. That's my character motivation, okay? What, being naughty? Yes. <laughs> so we're being evil. So yes. Because you want to be naughty. I'm being consistent. We can still get all the way to the dark side. Um, I just won't do... I see. I yeah. just won't do that one You can still thing. triangulate your way through there. Yes. Yeah. Um, well, yeah, there, there's so many choices. But they're really... So all of the, the... When you have that bracket... Yeah. Are all of the columns the same level? Um, Like what? Like what do you mean? All the columns, are they the same level? Like, like, of difficulty? No, 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 I meant like, uh... So, uh, so that middle there is pure normal. That's, no, that's row. Oh. I mean columns. Oh! No, those are just stage one, stage two, stage three, four, five, six. So where, where are we? We, we are, okay, we are on stage two, on the dark side, so we're that upper blue square. And our two missions are are tell um the symbols there tell us which path we're gonna go to. Okay, so if we went down, yes, we go back to the normal route. And that is also the is that the circuit level or not? I don't remember. I don't remember what that <laughs> what that level is. I think no, I think that one's a like a mountain level. Okay, um, so and why are we at this? Why is this amazing plot? Why does it have us <laughs> in the internet again? Um, because internet. We gotta destroy the crew. No, no, okay, no. Uh, actually, it was explained in the cutscene, and I just wasn't paying attention. Oh, fuck that so that was scene. my fault. No, I don't... <laughs> we don't need explanations. And look at look at how long her arms are. Her elbows are like at her knees. Okay, I, I was friends with a huge, huge Shadow Rouge shipper uh, when I was a kid, so uh, I did rouges. Uh, I did rouges. Are you telling me that Shadow and Rouge? Oh yeah, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. But, but, they. They like have more passive aggressive fucks than Rouge and Knuckles. Right, because Are Rouge you and Knuckles. with me? Well, okay. So the joke is, is that Rouge and Knuckles only have like that one scene in SA two together, and they have a rivalry. Whereas Shadow and Rouge actually have like a partnership. So there's more basis for a relationship. Just because you have a professional relationship with a hoe does not mean you got a fucker. <laughs> sure does. <laughs> oh shit! Ow! I hit a firewall. <laughs> Of course it's a firewall. Of course it's a firewall, Milo. What else is it? <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I promise not to be as bad at this internet stage as I was the other internet stage. Why are we at the Green Tower for 20 minutes? <laughs> I'm sorry. No, Again, it's, it's your fault for taking it like like you actually seem a little bit. No, like, I, like am, I am. I am. I Okay. You have some pride and I, I attack. Still, I still got little Haley heart for this game. Like, you know, and there's nothing wrong with when, that. When, J when Johnny showed that he cared about puzzle games, it like makes me go, <laughs> hmm, vulnerable victim. <laughs> well, and, and, okay, the, the, the difference with me and Johnny is that I know this game fucking sucks. <laughs> and I freely admit it. <laughs> if you saw John like something he grew up with, um, he's, he's less adamant about stuff he likes than stuff he hates. <laughs> Like, uh, we can't go to Red Lobster anymore <laughs> because he had a bad experience there one time. It had nothing to do with the food and everything to do with who he was with at that particular moment. And I won't go into that, but we can't go to Red Lobster anymore. <laughs> Johnny's not here to defend himself. Yeah, so. Johnny's not here to defend himself. We killed him for all you know. <laughs> 
Uh, Rouge, I don't want to follow you, sorry. Maybe it's the, oh yeah, Rouge was here. What the fuck? Oh yeah, we wanted to see her arms. Where's, <laughs> She's so but, but weird. Tentacly Boy has like six of them. Yeah, but Tentacly Boy is also an eye. Your point? You you can like poke at it with things. I don't want to fuck an eye. <laughs> a lot of people want to fuck Rouge, apparently. The, we needed, okay, I get it. Was though, Sonic we, the beginning of like thousands of, hundreds of thousands of people's furry awakening? Uh, maybe? Um, I also, I also will say that there are a lot of uh, young kids' films with dramatically so, sexualized furries, male and female. I guess for my generation, it was probably um, Space Jam Bunny. Yeah, um, what struck it to me was the uh, the Great Mouse Detective in that burlesque <laughs> show in the middle of that bar where this white mouse is dancing in barely anything and all of these men are hooting at her. <laughs> I'm like, what in the fuck? But, but... Well, I think you're bridge. right to say that the seeds were planted earlier. But yeah. I think the flowers spurted out of the ground and jizzed all over the place. At least I first noticed it when, like, high schoolers my age started to, like, draw me now! Rouge. Yeah. I, I think something, the dam broke with Rouge. Yeah. <laughs> what are you doing, you traitor? <laughs> Fuck yeah. you, he killed me! Well, yeah, what is, oh, okay, yeah, I see. Okay. We're not supposed to kill our alien friends. But then don't hit us, you fucktard. Yeah. I haven't played Sonic <laughs> Heroes, but it, like, so you tell me if they're if they're ripping off that more than Sonic Adventure 2, because I feel like there's there's bits and pieces of levels from SA2 that they're just like cutting and pasting out of and expanding upon. Um, yeah, I would say this has a lot more to do with SA2 as for not aesthetics, but as with design than than with heroes. <laughs> with the major flaw that you don't get to switch characters who would be able to navigate this better. <laughs> I mean, this is awesome. I mean, well, look how cool this looks. I mean, I, 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 I wanted to play Tron, but with Shadow. Right. <laughs> of course you did. Of course I did. Of course you did. I mean, well, fuck Jeff the... Bridges. Edit Shadow in there now. <laughs> Got nothing for you, Milo. Grab your stuff, head back to the internet. <laughs> Editor Johnny put Shadow the Hedgehog in Tron. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Oh, you said Jeff Bridges. I went with Jeff Probst, like a fucking idiot. I'm so sorry. There's only there's only <laughs> there's only so many Jeffs in Johnny's life. <laughs> <laughs> He's standing outside there, like, what the fuck? I'm gonna crucify you guys when I'm the editor. Oh, uh, you love us, dude. <laughs>